Okay, so this is a tutorial how to create a bump map with the same texture image only in V-Ray. So this is our benchmark where we test our materials. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to upload an uh, image and I'm, I want like a nice brick. We'll take this one. Now I have a bump map that I did in Photoshop, but this tutorial is how to do it without Photoshop. So I got it on my material on my uh, sketch of material. Now I'm going to go to uh, material, and I showed it once in one of my videos. I have a quick tip: is to go to the bitmap location, and if you Control C it, copy it, you have it in the memory, and then you don't need to find it again and again. So what I'm going to do: I'm going to press bump or displacement whatever you want we'll start with bump and we're going to choose color correction and on texture map I'm going to put my beat map now I'm closing this window and I'm just control P and now I got it here okay so we got it we got we got it here we can see our bitmap Okay, so now we have the image here, color. Now you can use it uh, as a bump map, but it's better to make it black and white. So this is what we're going to show. So in Photoshop, you can use the hue saturation. So to take the saturation out, and then if you want to take the light, and then you can make it with a contrast. So we are going to do it in SketchUp with this, um, with the color correction. So we'll take the saturation down, minus one. Now we got black and white color, so a map. And if we want the brightness, if you want it more bright, so your point, point 0.5 will make it more bright. We don't want it more bright, we want it more dark, so a little bit. So we put minus point 0.1, so we get it a little bit more darker, okay? And we want to put the contrast up to like two. We get a nice black and white map. And OK. Preview. Great. Now, if you want it to be in this map, we have, if you see, we have the white, the stucco in the middle, we have it in white, and the brick in black. If you want to invert it, what we'll do, we'll do it on the displacement. I'll show it on the displacement. What we're we going to put, we, we're going to put first invert. Okay. On the invert, we're going to put, this is a little bit more difficult, the color correction. And here, we're going to put the bitmap. We still can paste it. I'm just pasting it here. And I got this picture and now I have it here same process minus one minus o one and here contrast will put two like like it exactly the same just here we have it on the invert we can invert it now it's invert so we have it invert so if we'll see we got it like that and if we um, want it the same so we can change it without the invert we can put it or the same or with the invert and I'll render this material with this uh, bump and we'll see what we get okay so this is the result I got you can see I have a lot of bump I took even I, I tried one time and then I took my uh, value to 01 on the displacement because it was very high but you can still put it down and also on the bump but basically what I'm trying to show is that you can change in in SketchUp with no Photoshop your map to a black and white map and control it with same for for the diffuse if you want it to be more contrast or stuff like that you can just add it before your diffuse map and you'll get a very nice map Okay, this is for this. Please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.